Hi, welcome back to my series on F-16 Combat Pilot for the ZX Spectrum. Um, now, in the last video, something very odd happened. Uh, I destroyed some enemy tanks and installations, and I died whilst trying to land that mission. But um, uh, then when I tried to look at the map for the next mission, the map had completely changed. All the enemy installations and units were back. They had all the full complement of eight tank units again, um, and I wasn't really sure what had happened. And also, the uh, squadron I was in had changed, and I realised afterwards. Well, I went back and had a look at the video, and there was a very big clue in the debrief screen. Anyone see it? Did you see it? Um, there was a little message that I completely missed saying enemy has surrendered. So, by I think by perhaps destroying the last of their tank units, their offensive units apparently, even though they don't seem to cause any damage, um, I won the game. So I won Operation Conquest, uh, and I got post, according to the manual, you get promoted to a different squadron, and I think the same thing happens over again. Elements randomised in different places this time. Um, so, and I think that Spectrum games f from this era, and before at least, had um, this habit of just never actually showing you a completed screen, you complete them, they just got harder and repeated the same thing but harder and harder and harder and harder until you just couldn't win. And I suspect it might be the same thing here, even though this was one of the later games that came out for the Spectrum, I think. Um, and, and also, an argument against that, I guess, is there's going to be a finite a finite list of um, squadron names. So I'm, I'm just going to... Um, there's a finite list of squadron names, so surely you name yourself so many times. And perhaps you do get to see an end screen eventually. But I can't play that much, <laughs> to be honest. It's been fun, but... Um, to be honest, the look of the game is kind of a bit grating. I don't. It's, uh, I, I, don't I just can't <laughs> anymore. Um, so, yeah, I won. Woohoo! Um, what I'm going to show you now is some things that I. It's a tiny bit more content. What I want to do is. Um, oh god, damage the undercarriage. Well, shit. Now I'm flying around with my undercarriage down because I went too fast. Damaged it. Crap. Alright, well hopefully that went that again. What I want to do is show you a gun's kill, um, which might be quite hard, I guess. So fly up and wait for a MiG to come along and... Select my guns. Meaty sound effect there. Quite high. Change my HUD. Just to show damage. You can see you see undercarriage damage. So I went above, I think it's three hundred knots. Ah, uh, now I'm stuck at three hundred Ah, oh, it's because I'm zooming up into the air. My speed will be limited, my undercarriage sticking up. Um, okay, that's probably high enough. I don't think I've been this high game, hugging the ground, effort to avoid MIGs. So this is HUD mode, is in dogfight mode at the moment, where I've got forward looking radar. Um, Air to air radar, and there we go, right on cue. There's a bandit. So, what I'm going to do is, I guess he's going to shoot a missile at me. Um, try and avoid that. Close. Out. 
All right, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna show you a guns kill hopefully, and also I'll I'll also kill myself or not. Ah, oh, here comes up himself. Uh, F and C for flares and chaff. Carriage hanging down. Not a nice feeling. I think I can manoeuvre quite wildly because I'm not anywhere around. Well, how close is this? Okay. Defeated his missile. He shouldn't be into it. Right. Uh, yeah, I, I'll also kill myself a lot of times and try and lose the Operation Conquest and show you what screen you happen to see. Try and show you a close up of the MiG first. Oh, you can see it's a pretty dodgy wireframe representation. Um, now we're entering some sort of. Where is it? Oh, no. Some sort of circling game. Basically, how I played flight simulations when I was a kid, just end up circling and circling. circling. Oh, really? Come on. Oh. Uh oh. Now, was that launched by the plane or was that launched by internet? Ah, it's ground based. So I don't know. Oh, God. It's just a block at the moment, but if you do get close enough, you can see things like it's a MiG 29, so you can see the du du dual tail fins. Uh, I wonder if I can't get close enough because of my wheel stuck down. But you can see it's quite easy to um, oh come on to stay on the MiG's tail. It's shooting. It can't be the MiG, can it? Be a SAM radar, uh, a SAM unit. Oh, oh. I don't think close enough to show you. Are you? Burner? I wonder if I'm too far away to guns. Look at this, he's just gonna fly across my Ah uh, I think I'm I'm too slow to actually get anywhere near. This is a disappointment. It is quite easy to get guns. Uh, I might just eject. Try again. Ah, oh, blacking out. Right, perhaps I should say. Ah, oh. ah. Oh. Well, this isn't going too well. Maneuver. Well, okay. I died again. Alright. Yeah. So, yeah.
It's harder to see. There it is. Wow. Okay. I must be getting faster than him. Alright, well that was a close up. Now I'm gonna actually try and shoot that guy down. Guns. I hit the brakes and fly right by! Wasn't that exciting? Okay. Victory roll! Woohoo! Is that the first top gunner? Possibly the second possibly the second in this video actually. Apologize. I don't. Um Okay, I'm gonna eject and just keep ejecting until strength hey, what am I doing? Ah, it'd just be quicker to eject all the time. Or die. Die actually. Very dangerous speed. I'm stalling basically. Oh. Oh. It's just a leap into the ground. I'll just keep doing that until Ally surrendered. There we go. Well, that is the lose screen. There. Uh, Ally surrendered. So, what happens? Conquest. I'm still in the wild cannon, and the whole thing starts again. So I haven't been promoted, but I haven't been demoted. All right, I think is there anything else I want to say? Um, I think that's it for F-16 Combat Pilot on the Zerg Spectrum. It's been good fun. Uh, I don't think I want to go back and do much more though. I think I'm done with this game. Uh, if anyone has any suggestions for the next game, there's been a couple already. I think someone wanted to see um, Falcon or Falcon 3, I think. I'm not too sure about those games. I think one was out for the ST and the Amiga, and Falcon 3 was a PC only release uh, later on. I'm, I'm not sure if I'm right there. Um, I'm, I've never got introduced to those games. I'm not really sure. I mean, I'd like to look at them, and they're on the list, but I don't think they're next. Um, seriously thinking about F-16 Combat Pilot for the Atari ST. Show you the differences there between the 8-bit and the 16-bit versions. Um, also, I'm very interested in F-19 Stealth Fighter for the Atari ST. Uh, possibly for the PC. I've played the Atari ST version. Um, the PC version... I, if the graphics are as good, because I, I don't like the CDA graphics on PC games, uh, if the graphics are as good but the frame rate is smoother, I might use the PC version. Or I think there was, was there F19 Stealth Fighter 2.0 or something, something like that, an, an updated version that had the actual real Stealth Fighter instead of the F19? Um, I don't know. Um, probably not going to start a series for a few weeks while I do house renovations so um, we'll see how it goes but um, 
leave a comment um, and like these videos if if you um if you have enjoyed this series please please like this video um and leave a comment also um thanks for watching i'll see you in the next series